Alright guys, uh, here's another tutorial just for educational purposes. I'm going to be showing you how to change the IMEI number plus pin of a BlackBerry. Now this is, uh, I believe, illegal in a lot of places. So just make sure you can do it and this is just for educational purpose. We're not responsible in any way you use this. So what you're going to need for this is pack 4 from the Ferris Gold, uh, the BlackBerry tool. We're going to run the BlackBerry tool. Okay, now you're going to go to MISC, well IMEI. Notice that you can't change the IMEI or the BB pin. The way you can change this is when you go to MISC, you go fast code read disable. Now you go back to IMEI and you can enter an IMEI number. Now I'm going to generate one. So I'm just going to use this one for now. Actually, what we're going to do is we're going to see what the IMEI number of the BlackBerry right now I have. I have an 8300. So we're just going to read it. Oops. So I'm going to take out the cord, plug it back in, and read. Okay, so this is the IMEI number. We're going to change that to yeah, something like three five uh, use that something like this we're going to change it to this so you go over here and paste and the pin I want to change to paste so change IMEI and pin and the map I want the map to stay the same so I am going to paste it like this and so we're changing it from this to this and we're changing the pen to and we're going to click do job and it's going to start doing its job right now Okay, so when it's done, it's just going to come up with this. You just wait, and the phone will turn on. And what you have to do is remove the USB cable from the phone, push OK, then attach the USB cable back. Okay, now we're going to wait again. Okay, same thing again. So remove USB cable, push OK, attach the USB cable again. And we're going to wait until it pops up again. OK, again it pops up, remove USB cable, push OK, then connect the USB cable to the BlackBerry again. OK, now it pops up asking you for to select this file, SFI file. I put it in the desktop, I'm going to show you how to get this file, but for now I'm just going to select it. Now as it restores my phone, uh, we're going to go ahead and see how we can get this file from Furious Gold. You go to Furious Gold and the maintenance tool. Okay. As the maintenance tool is loading, you go, uh, when it's done loading, go, click go to support area and close the maintenance tool. You don't want it to interfere with the BlackBerry tool. Now when you're in the Furious Gold website, just go down and look to go down go to download area, then click pack for Blackberry tool, SFI right over here, and mine is at 8300, so Blackberry 8300. And um, I downloaded this one version 4.5.0.81 and that's what this file that we chose over here so I'm just gonna wait until it's done loading and we'll resume the video from there okay so after the phone power is on just remove the USB cable okay push OK and now your phone should be fine okay so after it's done and everything loads uh, Technically, this is the IMEI number we wanted to load on the BlackBerry, so we're going to check if it did it. We go to FBL, read, and there we go. 
it's the same IMEI number and when I go to my Blackberry the pin is the same so everything is changed and that is it and in my next video I'll be making another video if there was any errors in the process how to fix those errors so hope you enjoy this is Riz from www.furiousgold.com